Well, well, it's the 11th of June 2018, oh, six, ten hours, Belgium are out, it's the England match tonight, there's still no rain, you can see the mountain, it looks a bit, hmm, yellowish. Anyway, I've got a quality plan, off to Bridge End, could be an issue <laughs> with all the tweets about Riva Trains Wales, we shall see, got an e-ticket. Moving on. Oh look, they've done nothing about that forest. I think this might be the Bargoid Flyer. We shall see. Anyway, I'm going the, in the opposite direction. Here, yeah, it's the Bargoid Flyer. Bridgend International. Where it is? A cooling breeze. Right, Van Costa. It's close, I know. Been to Costa, now spoons. And if the bar's open. Hope so. If not, on his use. Very breezy. A little overcast. It's rather pleasant to be. As we're in Mr. Manning land, let's start with the carpet and then the beer. Mr. Manning is, of course, in NYC, where he's sharing photos of uh, Google Photos. Anyway, Rombold, R-O-M-B-A-L-D, from the Ilkley Brewery. Couldn't this powered by beer? 4.6% alcohol by volume. American Amber Ale. Darker than amber, I would say. Hmm. Malty, but not sweet. And quite bitter. Maybe a little thin, but that's because it's quite cool. Mm, sort of burnt notes in the finish. Burnt notes and bitter. Mm. Be pleasant a bit. And number two, Little John Cask Beer by Milestone. 5% alcohol by volume. I think, given the colour and the. Uh, how much of an aroma? And the taste. The taste is distinctly coffee. With a burnt finish. Mm, porterish, stoutish. B plus. Not bad. The coach. Free house. Should be opening. Two months. Bridge end. Kind of tons of beers. Flags. Um, looks like we would. Anyway, Mr. Man in town. Mordello, Mordello, Ooh, Porter, 5.2% alcohol by volume, a Milk Street Brewery of Frome, West Country. Mm -hmm. <coughs> that is <coughs> nice. Full body. Smooth, getting coffee, burnt notes, nice bitter finish, B plus in a bit. Something from mold, lot of poly, loca poly, Simcoe, Wainia. Extra pale ale, 4.3% alcohol by volume, back of chips. Fruity, tasty, refreshing, pinly on the tongue, easily a B. Love it. 
I'm draft. Yeah, you can. Yeah, no. Yeah. <laughs> and it's only just a river. Although there's some storms forecast for Friday. Just opened a bit late. However, so my somewhat of an excellent selection. Anyway, Buxton SPA special pale ale from the Buxton Brewery, 4.1% alcohol by volume. Cork, Mr. Mine. Fruity, three plus in a bit. Nicely refreshing. Garage Brewing, which I think they're from Barcelona, which makes them Catalans. Super IPA, six percent alcohol by volume. That's okay, so I get the right color temperature. Mmm, fruity aroma. Mm -hmm. I think as it warms up it'll become an even more of a fruit bomb and your B++ because yeah so this is a new one for me Bone Machine Brew Co I've got that up 4.7% alcohol by volume Cloud Piercer New Zealand Pale Ale Colors my uh, nose. And that's, oh, that's a bit of fruitiness in there. Oh, that's nice. Gently fruity, a little bit sharp. Quite refreshing. Yeah, I like that. B plus plus. Mm. 